Yo, what's going on my NFT collectors, my crypto heads, my DC fanatics, and everybody else on YouTube. It's your bro me, The Gale, back at it again with a, another NFT update video. Let's do it. What's happening my friends? So, um, there's another NFT project that's going to drop in about nine days. In this video, I just want to bring it to your attention uh, maybe you've heard about it already, but I wanted to do my video and my research on it. Uh, I'm just basically basically going to read the read the website and you know hop into the Discord and see what they're talking about, and then I'm going to give you my personal thoughts on it, and then we're going to call it a video. So without further ado, let's breeze into. Okay, so we are on nft.dcuniverse.com. Bat cow collection. Heat the call join the faction so you'll notice there is a countdown at the bottom of the screen there is nine days 16 hours 30 minutes and 42 seconds left until the minting day so claim your cow create a new legend batman is building a faction to defend gotham collect one of 200,000 unique bat cows and unlock a two plus year roadmap of features benefits and value the Bat Cow Collection will be integrated into future stories from DC Comics, priced at 300 USD. Alright, so that's kind of interesting. Here's a link to the Discord, which you're going to want to join. We'll talk about that uh, later. So, a two-year journey featuring updates every 52 days. As your story unfolds, Batman will upgrade your cow with new features unlocking access to the wider world of DC. So that's interesting. Seems like uh, every 52 days there's going to be upgrades or um, it's going to unlock features like it just said. So nothing more to say there. Unprecedented access. Access to exclusive products and collectibles. Access to exclusive Bat Cow apparel collection. Exclusive access and benefits at DC fan events. Advanced access to DC NFT collections. The Bat Cow collection will be integrated into future stories from DC Comics. Additional surprises, features, and updates yet to be revealed. So that's quite a few, that's quite a bit of uh, things right there by itself. I like the DC fan events and I like the fact that some of these cows might be integrated into DC Comics. Uh, that's interesting. It would be really awesome to see your particular cow uh, in an official DC comic. Uh, exclusive features. New functionality for DC Fandom 2021 holders or NFT holders. Collections for Bat Cow holders only. New engagement mechanics unlock exclusive drops. AR ready for social media integration. Private fan forum, exclusive content, and more. Third party wallet integration and metaverse ready design for future experiences. So that is very awesome as well. Uh, I like the fact that. There's going to be a social media integration, probably like Snapchat or um, TikTok. That would be awesome. Uh, Third-party wallet integration, probably meaning MetaMask and Trust Wallet or whatever. Um, but yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Looks like a lot of stuff. So uh, let's keep going. Billions of possibilities. Each Bat Cow is unique, featuring components, materials, patterns, and colors from the history of Batman. Your cow will be generated on purchase from over 2 billion possible combinations. Cows created in collaboration with Daz 3D. So that's cool. Uh, okay, so here's, here's the uh, traits it looks like. So there's 2 billion plus combinations. There's 3 historic cows. There's 10 light, light effects. 5 different jaws. 192 materials. 6 dominoes. 3 ear mods. 20 backgrounds. And four forehead mods so any combination of these could be used to create our individual cowl so each one is going to be unique no doubt and uh yeah depending on what tra traits they get uh will depend on the rarity i guess that will determine the rarity so that's uh kind of interesting so the journey a two-year journey of features and fun with something new every 52 days for all bat cow holders so April 26 uh, will be the uh, day we can purchase our cowl, and in May is going to be the reveal day. So unbox your bat cow and discover the attributes, rarity, and storyline of your unique collectible. Also in May, we're going to be able to buy and sell any DC 
NFTs minted on the Palm Network. Collections supported at launch include Bat Cows, The Batman Collection, and DC Fandom 2021. Uh, let's see. Bat Cows become canon between uh, the year 2022 and 2023. Uh, the Bat Cow Collection will be integrated into future stories from the DC Comics. Okay, okay. So, yeah, as we scroll, as the year goes on, there's going to be more um, access to different things, you know, regarding DC. So that'll be interesting to see. Uh, you guys can check out the website on your own time for that. But here's some frequently asked questions. So um, we'll skip the first two. That's kind of rudimentary. What is the Palm Network? The Palm Network is a new token powered ecosystem for NFTs, which is connected to Ethereum and features low gas cost, fast transaction, finality, and 99.9 .9 more energy efficient than proof of work systems such as Bitcoin and Ethereum. All right. Uh, let's see, what blockchain are the DC NFTs minted on? The NFTs available on nft.dcuniverse.com are minted on the Palm Network. And we just said what the Palm Network was. So uh, let's see here. Where are my DC NFTs stored? When you create a DC NFT account, Palm Studio will custody your DC NFTs in Palm Studio owned blockchain wallets for your convenience. You can manage your DC NFT by logging on to your DC NFT account where you can give us instructions for your DC NFT. All right. Uh, what else? What else? Let's see. How many bat cows are available and how much do they cost? There's 200,000 bat cows and they'll cost $300. How many bat cow NFTs can I purchase? While account holders may purchase as many bat cow NFTs as they desire, there is a limit to how much a single account may purchase during any given time period. Purchase limits for each verified DC NFT account daily, three hundred or three thousand, and weekly, five thousand dollars. All right, let's see, let's see. Uh, will I be able to sell my bat cow? DC NFTs will be eligible for listing on the DC NFT universe secondary market starting in May 2022. And how can I pay for a bat cow NFT? You can purchase your bat cow with a Visa or Master card, credit or debit card. All right, so that's all that's on the um, official webpage for the most part. Let's go to the Discord where we will get more information. Okay, so I joined their Discord server where they currently have uh, 10,324 members. Now under the announcements server, there is more alpha for us to behold. So there is early access to these cows. In addition to DC fandom NFT holders, anyone who owns a Nifty's Matrix Avatar NFT by Monday, April 18th at 2 p.m. PST will have the opportunity to mint a bat cow in the early access window. As a reminder, the bat cow's early access window will be open on April 26th with full public sale beginning on April 27th. How to participate. If you already own a Nifty's Matrix avatar, create your DC Universe account here by Wednesday, April 20th uh, at 10 a.m. PST. Be sure to use the same email address and Twitter account that you use to connect your Nifty's account. If you don't already own a Matrix avatar, you can grab your favorite Matrix avatar from the secondary marketplace before Monday, April 18th at 2 p.m. PST. Once the above is completed, create your DC Universe account. So, uh, if, if you believe that these uh, Batman cows are going to sell out, if you think it's going to be heavy demand, then you might want to have uh, get early access to these Bat cows, uh, which I just uh, described here. So there was a DC fandom NFT drop earlier in the year or last year. Um, I think it was like the floppy disk looking NFT. If you have one of those then you can get pre-sale access or if you buy one of these uh, uh, matrix avatars, let's click on that actually. Um, they had a drop earlier or late last year where you could have got some matrix NF NFTs. And um, anyway, let's see here. Let's see here. Yeah, so if you have access to one of these Matrix NFTs, then you're going to be able to um, get early access to these Bat Cows. So these are fairly affordable. All we have to do is buy one of these uh, before basically Monday. So we have like a day to do it. That's why I'm making this video so people can do it if they really want to uh, take advantage of this opportunity. So um, 
I'm not going to go through the process of how to do this. I got to figure out how to do it myself. But yeah, if you buy one of these NFTs and connect it to your uh, DC NFT account, then um, yeah, that's how you get early access. So with that, let us move on. Okay, so for my personal thoughts on this uh, Bat Cow NFT drop, uh, initially I was not really interested in uh, getting one of these because I thought $300 for an edition size of 200000 was kind of uh, a bit much, but I was looking at it from a profit side, like if I wanted to sell my Bat Cow and take profit, but uh, I think when it comes to this project, the utility is what matters most here, and... Um, like it said, this is a two-year project. You know, you get upgrades every 52 days, so it's gonna be a it's gonna be a, a long-term thing. You know, it's gonna be spread out. So if you buy one of these bad cows, it you know it, you shouldn't be looking to flip these because they may even go under retail if they don't if they sell out at all. So, but I'm thinking about getting one because I am kind of heavily invested into DC NFTs. Uh, I'm on the VV app where I have the Todd McFarlane Batman amongst many other DC collectibles, NFTs. And then I'm also on the Hero platform where I have a whole bunch of DC trading card NFTs. So what it seems to me is that DC is trying to ex trying to create a uh, something like a decentralized ecosystem. They have many NFTs on different platforms. And I think these bat cows might be their way of kind of like tying it all together. You know what I'm saying? Like... Um, you know, you might get like maybe a, a, a Lao listed or white listed for a hero drop if you own a cow or maybe even something that has to do with VV. Like it's it's too early in the game to say what's what, but I think as time goes on, I think we may be surprised with these bat cows. And, you know, if anything, it's only $300, right? Like we spent, I've spent more money on crazier things, so... I think I may get one of these bad cows, and I, I do believe Jim Lee is behind this project, so that's just another, uh, you know, another bonus, so, you know, he's, he's like, really into DC, he's like, you know, I think he's like a lead, lead something, you know, you know, Jim Lee is pretty big, is what I'm trying to say, so anyway, yeah, I think I may get one of these, there's nine days for me to really figure it out, but if I want to get early access, then I might have to buy one of these uh, Matrix things by Monday, that's if I think it's going to sell out. Do I think it's going to sell out? It's hard to say. There's 200,000 of these. And, uh, you know, NFTs aren't mainstream. Mainstream. I don't know how many people are aware of NFTs. So I'm not sure if these will sell out. They possibly could go even under retail. So I probably, we, we might be able to wait and get these for even cheaper. But I do want to uh, get one of these random uh, traits. So I want, I want to get, you know, I want to get it generated you know, initially owned by me, I think. So I will probably pay retail for one of these things. But uh, that's that's my current thoughts on it. I just wanted to put the information out there for you guys if you haven't already heard. And uh, yeah, so without further ado, or <laughs> let's move on. And that's the video, my friends. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. If you learned something or enjoyed the content, feel free to drop a like on the video and consider subscribing for more NFT content like this. So yeah, I just wanted to, once again, bring this to your attention. Um, you know, these cows could be something. It could be a flop. Um, you know, I would very, I would, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to think about them. It's so early. But there is a lot of utility that seems to be coming with it. So I may take a shot. You know, we're early in this NFT game. And you never know what's going to come of these NFTs. I've seen a few surprises in my time already in this space. So anything could happen. And with that being said, I am definitely not a financial advisor. Nothing I say is financial advice because I am learning just like you guys. I am just your friendly neighborhood genius. <laughs> sharing his thoughts and opinions and updating you guys in this NFT space. So take everything that you hear from me with a grain of salt because things could change. Change, change. And with that being said, um, thank you for watching and I will catch you guys in my next video. Until then, peace out and huddle strong, my friends. And remember, be like water, stay liquid. Later.